We'll guide you through how to play Steam games on your phone. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. So first of all in Steam, go to the top left and click on Steam and go and open up your settings. On the left here, you then need to go down to Remote Play. And what you need to do is make sure Enable Remote Play is toggled on like so. And then what you need to do is come onto your phone. This could be an iPhone or an Android and then open up the App Store or Google Play Store and you need to go and search for Steam Link. Here it is. Go and download it and then click on open and it'll go and start up. You'll need to go and rotate your phone around as you can see. And then it says it wants to use Bluetooth. I'll just click OK there um, and also just press allow there as well. So then what we can do is go and click on get started and it's now going to be scanning for computers. As you can see, it's actually gone and found mine there. If yours hasn't, then what you can do is just go and click on other computer and you go and get a pin there. And then on your computer, click on pair Steam link. And you then need to go and type that in. After you have, click on confirm like so, and then it'll go and take a moment. And then what you can do is go and click on the computer like so. And then what it's going to do is go and do an internet test. It will say complete and you can go and click OK. And then what you can do is go and click on start playing just like so. It says welcome to big picture. You can then go and tap. And also you can go and see the controls appear on, on your screen as well. In this case here, I want to go and play on the Goose Goose Duck game. So I'll then go and select it and I'll then go and click on stream. And so the game is now loading and we can go and start playing. If you find you can't go and use the mouse, then go and click on the three dots in the top right and then you can click on it and you've now gone and enabled it. And then we can go and close off this menu here. And then as you can see, you can move the cursor around to go and click on things. And so you get the idea. Once you finish, click on the three dots in the top left and you can then go and click on the power button and you can then go and stop the game like so, or you could stop streaming and then you'll be taken back uh, to Steam, as you can see. And if you then click on stop streaming like so, you'll then just be brought back to the Steam link page.